Hi, I'm Lou Freeman. My new video, Modern Life, is about how to create fashion and beauty images with headshots and lifestyle photography. One of my favorite tools to make beauty shoots with is the Westcott Ice Light. It's daylight balanced and has a rheostat and variable brightness and darkness, and it can last up to about an hour of shooting. In this particular photo shoot, I created a beauty box by using small bungee cords and two light stands to formulate a square. After I make this square at full power, I can achieve the look of a ring light, but with much softer effects. I can also choose to make one side of it or one corner of it lighter or darker with a variable rheostat. One of the ways that I like to light people is from, a, I call it the beauty box perspective, light from all around. So sometimes I don't necessarily want the quality of light from a strobe or from a speed light through a modifier. I like something that has a cool, soft luminescence. And I've used for years KinoFlow panels and KinoFlow Diva lights. And in a constant pursuit to move quickly and still have the same kind of look, I found these awesome uh, lights from Westcott called the Ice Light. And I'm gonna slowly turn this one up so you can see how beautiful the quality of light is. It has a rheostat on the side and a power switch on and off here. And it has a tripod socket here. So if you are working by yourself shooting a video, you could use it to illuminate someone's face. But for me, it's presented a really awesome quality of light for beauty shots. It has an artistic edge. And I like to blend them with strobe or flash. Today we paired four together and stacked them on top of each other and made a box, something like this. And I had just enough room to shoot through with my camera. The color temperature is pure daylight and it offers a really lovely quality of light and they're very easy to move around if you want a little more up light or a little less. What you have to do is just simply move the light or dim the rheostat right here on the front button. The beauty box is a little too bizarre if you want to shoot commercial headshots. You want to keep the catch lights in the eyes more natural looking. If you're going to shoot art, beauty, and fashion, you might want to try something like the ice lights. One of the reasons why I chose to use the ice lights in this particular shoot is the mood they allow me to create. The quality of light is an essential part of editorial shoot in opposite way that you would create a commercial headshot.